Hi everybody, good day. Welcome to my channel. Grab yourselves a drink, grab yourselves a snack, and let's have a chit chat down under. Today I haven't got little guy, I've got big girl, and this Hello. is Pauline. How are you all? Pauline and I met about 19 or 20 years ago um, when we did reborn um, dolls together, and Pauline was actually helping me a little bit and learning and teaching and doing other things. Now we do cards together. Um, once my house is organized, we will get back into seeing one another. We see each other once a week, on usually on a Tuesday, mm -hmm. and we do either cards or we do journaling or we do, I, well, we used to do reborn dolls together, but Pauline has Even stopped doing them. Even. So, yeah, so we will probably, um, Pauline's staying with me for a couple of days. She's hurt her knee and cannot drive and cannot walk. Um, yeah, so I've told her she can come and stay with me for a couple of days and we can get up to no good. <laughs> and Pauline's been like a second mum to me because we get on very well. And yeah, so, and I'm her daughter's age, so we're like... Good mates, aren't we? We are very good mates, yes. Yeah. So when you want to look, you've got to look into here, not there. Okay. Because otherwise you're not looking at the people. Oh. I've noticed that on a few of my videos. I'm sorry, guys, but sometimes I check out the product I'm hauling and, yeah, I notice that I'm actually not looking at you guys. I do apologise. Um, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I appreciate you stopping by. I have um, got a few new subscribers, so welcome to you. I won't mention you by name unless you want me to do a shout out for you. Um, if you do want that, um, please leave a comment and I will <coughs> certainly give a shout out to you. But welcome, I have two new subscribers. Um, okay, so first up before we start, I wanna have a little talk about the rings that I hauled um, maybe a week or two ago, was it? I think so. And what they were, they were these lovely, beautiful cubic zirconia rings and a little little red thing. Now, I said that I do have very high acidity in my skin and I knew that my body would probably chew all the gold off and it has done exactly that. They have tarnished, they're no longer gold and that was only from two days of wear. So I'm very disappointed um, this one I think is worn on the inside. I don't know if you can see it. See how it's gone down to copper. The shine is gone. And this one is also tarnished, but not as bad. This one actually held up a little bit better, but it has tarnished. See how it's gone to copper? The gold's come off. Unfortunately, there's a lot that I can't wear i can't wear leather watch straps because my body eats them and it becomes brittle and it just oh, snaps <laughs> i can't wear anything but gold so boohoo so sad not i'm very happy about that um yeah so anything that's not gold at least nine carat gold my skin eats it so if i wear a, one of those stretchy watches or anything uh, metallic ones then my body will actually chew all the metal and it pits it and then I end up with a really bad rash. So I'm allergic to a lot of things, which is the reason why my eyeliner is actually tattooed on. Um, I will eventually get my eyebrows tattooed and my lips tattooed because I am allergic to a lot of stuff. And I've actually bought so many beautiful little earring sets that I've recently haul, um, bought on Timu, so I will be hauling them, but I don't have much hope for them. Well, my advice is if you're going to buy rings or earrings, stainless steel. Yes. They don't tarnish. That's exactly right. Yeah. So Timu now has actually got um, gold-coloured earrings. They look like this colour gold. But they actually have the posts are actually standard sterling steel. silver. Oh, yes, or st silver, sterling yeah. silver or standard steel. So I, I actually look out for those now. So that's a really good tip, Pauline. Mm. Well done. Now, okay, so we've gotten past those rings. So I will probably, I don't know anybody who has, I oh, actually I do know someone who's got young girls, but they're probably way too big for them because I've got chunky man hands. <laughs> So I'm not feminine at all. My brother that's directly below me, I have five brothers. Well, I had five. My oldest brother died just under a year ago. Um, 
but my brother that's directly below me, he's one year younger than me, and he has the most daintiest, beautiful hands. They're tapered fingers, they're so, and he's got lovely long nails. And my youngest brother has really long nails, and I can't grow mine. And oh, sorry guys, I was meant to put new stick ons you on. You were too. And I forgot, <laughs> Pauline, I forgot. Oh. We were too busy eating. We had chicken, uh, no, fettuccine, fettuccine carbonara. Chicken fettuccine carbonara, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to have a sip out of my hauled Stanley dupe. Pauline, where's your drink? I have one too. Pauline has a Stanley dupe as well, but hers is a smaller version without the handle. But hers is really fancy and glittery. Both ombre. Okay. So, we found your haul. I have no idea what I paid for this, but I found it amongst the... Oh, I'll show you the bags first. Guys, I have this massive, massive box. It's got mo mostly boxes. And I also have... Oh, oops. Oh, broken. <laughs> this bag. Because the other one's mostly furniture. So, I will do the smaller bag first but Pauline's going to help me because she's staying the night for two nights so I'm actually looking forward to that but first up we have a little fashion jewelry and it's a little love heart and it's oops I've got to see the camera it's got little paw print and does it have anything on the back and it's just patterned on the back do apologize for the nails guys but you can hold that up. It's very pretty. Pretty. So I probably won't be able to wear that. Would you like to have that? I'll wear it. Well, you can have it. There you go. Oh, thank gift, you. Gift for you. <laughs> it pays to be my friend. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I, I saw what I did to the gold ones. Can you imagine what I'm going to do to those ones? Okay, this is going to be fun. I've got a lot of boxed items in these because, as you will know, if you are new to my channel I moved into a new house probably almost two months ago now so I have bought a few items for the house um, if you're returning thank you for returning I do appreciate and love you all and yeah okay what is this I have no idea okay this <laughs> I paid a little 943 and it's now 878. I think, oh, I know what it is. This I'm going to use under the sink or under the, in the laundry, or maybe even in the wardrobe, I'm not sure yet. But what it is, it's one of those, yes, see, it's great having guests, special <laughs> guests. Okay, so what it is, it's an extendable um, rail, so you can, you, when you've got your desired length you twist it and it stays but yeah it's got the the rubber feet and so on both ends so yeah you it goes to about a meter how do you make it stay on the wall it's got the rubber feet so that will mm. stick and and when you then tighten this part like that it's tight oh good but good I, I have to <laughs> hey no 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 it's not it's not a toilet <laughs> rail oh. No, it's not one of those. But anyway, so you get the idea. So it's a telescopic rail. So I, I don't know whether I'm going to use it under the sink or... For towels. No, for, I was actually going to use for cleaning products. You know, the ones, that, the spray oh, bottles yeah, and yeah. just hook them all yeah. on. Makes sense? Okay, so that's the first item. Next up, we have a box. This is actually for my son, my older son. He's moving back we have a granny flat and so he's moving in there with a mate of his so we actually have to convert the granny flat from a one bedroom to a two bedroom because they're not a couple not that there's anything wrong with that but they're not a couple not. so they've been friends since prep or pre, you know preschool and so we're helping the, the friend out but yeah so he's moving back in august and i thought this would be a really cool little gift because he's quirky like me and what it is have you got the little poo it won't come out oh <laughs> hang on we'll poke it like that oh 
He's constipated. It won't come out. <laughs> Hang on. I might have to poke it through. Like that. Okay, so you hold that up. So what it is, guys, it's a little balloon dog and Pauline hold it up behind his what? butt. Really? Yeah. That's his poo. Look. Oh. So that's... I'll, I'll set it. Look, I'll put it on here. Look. So it's a balloon dog. <laughs> oh. <laughs> And, oh. and my son being quirky, he'll love that. But we won't mention names because we don't mention anybody's names unless we get permission. So, yeah, so that's actually a gift for him. As it's going to be a little housewarming gift for him. Oh, did I say how much I paid? Um, $6.45, now $7.59. $7.59. Okay, next up we have a... Oh, it's already falling out. That's clever. Okay, it's... A dead rat. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's 183 <clears throat> It's sold out. However, I have seen other vendors and they're about $1.32. And what it is, it's a wind-up mouse. I don't know why I bought this because I do not have a cat. Why would I have bought this? I have this? no idea. Why did I buy this? Maybe I bought it to put... I actually have a big library, so I was going to stick it on the on the books. I don't know. You it's can... not even pretty. I know. I don't know. It's ugly. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> I don't know why I bought that thing. I seriously don't know why oh. I bought that thing. My hair's just been washed and it's fluffy. It's. Oh. I hardly ever wear my hair out. Oh, that's the other bag. That's a price. No. Oh, yeah, I said it. 183 oh. sold out, but well, other vendors have it for 132. Okay. Oh, I thought I wasn't doing my job there. Uh, and there's another box. So how was your weekend, guys? I had a very quiet weekend. I didn't do much. We stayed home. Didn't do much at all. Okay, so I paid 9.34, now 9.45. You can hold this up. And it is... Oh, I love this. So it's from Big Bang Theory. And... Oh, soft kitty, warm kitty. Yeah, little ball of yeah. fur. Everybody will know that yeah. one. Yeah. Well, apparently they now have a parody one, and it says mm. "Angry Kitty something something something," and it's quite funny. But I, I love that because yeah, yeah, I really like that. Sheldon. Sheldon. Yeah. yeah. I'll put it back in here because I'll like Erin from Hey Everybody. I have a mug fetish. And I've got nowhere to put it. I've got no room, but I will have to find somewhere to put it. I probably won't use it, but... Okay, next up we have something for Little Guy. And it is... I paid $6.39. It's still $6.39. And what it is... I'll get you to hold the grill up. And what it is, it's a grid and it opens up. It's like a, it's actually got a little handle too, Pauline. Oh, it's Yeah. It's got, no, it's got little things in it. If you yeah. open it up, you can open it up this way, that way. Hold it out, yeah. How cool is that? Okay, so what it is, guys, it's got little small and large little beady things, and you can make things. So the little guy gets bored really easy. He's got ADHD, so he gets bored quick. Younger ones can learn how to do letters and numbers and shapes. But little guy will probably be more tempted to do the more difficult ones. And so he stays with me um, a lot over the holidays. So, yeah, so they take them out and they put them on this grid. And, yeah, so I will pop that in there with it so you can follow along. Okie dokie. That's a great idea, isn't it? Yeah. I like the colours. It's very bright. So I actually, when I do buy things for little guy, what I do, I think caught up on that. What I do <coughs> is I put him in his wardrobe and then when he goes to get his balance board, for the guy, for you guys who have been here before, um, do you remember when I hauled that big balance board for him, the big blue one? Well, he grabs that out and um, sits on it and does what he does. I usually put all the, the new gifts on that and he gets a real buzz out of that. He says, oh, you spoiled me so much. Okay, guys, this is, I paid 
6.74, they're now 7.19, and I actually saw Shannon D haul these, and I thought they were, I think Shannon hauled them from Shenanigans, 3 2 oh, one. They? They're birds, but what they are, they're little feeders. So what you do is you put water in them, and then pop them into the pot plants, and they slowly water the plants. Oh. So when you go away for the weekend or... For yeah. a week or so, you just fill them with water, and there's five of them for what did I say? For seven dollars nineteen. Yeah, so they're cute, aren't they? So I'm I'm actually going to use them anyway because when you have those um, plants that need a lot of water, um, yeah, I do try to water them. You don't want to put them back in the bag. Ah uh, no, it's fine. Oh, I think I wrecked the bag, didn't I? Yeah, I did. I should have thought about that, shouldn't I? Okay, next up we have an item. It's a peeler. It's an orange peeler and it cost me $1.35, now $1.43. And what it is, it is, oh, it's an orange peeler. So you, I guess you could use it for... Oh, we had an orange here we could show you, but we don't. No, I don't. I used to have an orange <laughs> tree at the old house, but it's been, it's still there, but... Okay, so what it is, is this sharp bit there, the little pointy bit, you have your orange and you run it across the orange and make a groove. And then you use this bit to pry the peel off. And then you can use, the, there's a little sharp blade. Can you see that? And you can chop up the bits with that. Yeah. So it's a little orange. It looks a bit like a dolphin. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. So that's what that is. And I have this bin, but because I cleaned up this room today, I have got no room in it. Okay, I might move that over here so I can push it down. Oh, there's not a lot of room in there. We got so much to haul. Start putting things on the shelves behind you. No, that's no. Okay, next up we have a box. We have an item. Uh, I paid $16.39, they're now $20.98. It is 26 and a half centimetres tall, 10.5 centimetres. Is it a Stanley cup? Or 10, 10 and a half inches. <coughs> no, it's not. It's actually a resin. If I think it is what I think it is, it's a resin statue of a man going, oh. Well, half a face, half a man. Oh, I'm not going to be able to get this out. Oh, here's that styrofoam. Pull it out. Oh, 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 okay, let's have a look. I just want to put a few night. Oh, I hate styrofoam. Look, it's already going everywhere. Yeah. It's like, have you ever had one of those bean bags? Yeah. And you've and got those styrofoam balls yep. and then the kids open it. And you end up with these little balls everywhere. It is him. It is what I thought it was. Oh, look at that. And it's gold coloured. It's got little felt feet on the bottom. And it's, it's a face. See that? Because I'm going to put it in my library. Oh, yeah. On the shelf. I thought that was really nice. It's quite nice. It's very detailed. It's quite nice, isn't it, guys? Yeah, I like it. Do you like it? I'll I'm stick not, it there for now. Not commenting. <laughs> not co okay, so obviously not. <laughs> okay, hydrate. Hydrate again. Whoops. I'm going to end up knocking all this over. Now, I don't know why I bought this again. Because I think I have actually hauled this a couple of weeks ago. And now I've got another one. I mean, I've only got two hands. How many more do I need? It is. It has a little USB charger. It's a... A, um, what do you call them? Yeah, for your nails. Yeah, I know it's for your nails, but what do they call them? What, what is it called? Nail, or oh, nail dryer lamp. LED nail dryer lamp. And you can, you turn it on up here and you can pick whether you want 30 seconds, 60 seconds, or 90 seconds. It has the ultraviolet or whatever it is, UV, is it? And now she's got three of them. Now I've got three because Pauline gave me one. <laughs> but she didn't give me the charger with it. 
I have never found it. Okay, so, but anyway, so now I've got one for each hand plus a spare. So, yeah, so now I've got three of them. Go figure why I needed three. Maybe I'll start my own cell on. Oh, you've got <laughs> to. Okay, I'll leave that in there. Okay, throw that away after. Oh, so many things in here, Pauline. Okay, next up we have, okay, I definitely saw Shannon haul these. Um, Shannon is a flight attendant and she loves gardening when she's on days off and I saw her haul these and I love them. $2.79, now $2.48 and what they are is, because I'm loving my new garden, you can put one on too. So what it is, guys, is they are gloves and they have the little bear claws on them so you can dig. Now you can either get them without the claws or you can get one with a claw and one plain but in my case i got two claws dangerous so, uh, <laughs> so you know cat fight. <laughs> <laughs> all right so yeah so i got both of them so i'm actually going to use those because i'm loving my new garden i weeded weeded my garden and i found eight azalea plants in there which i thought was fantastic Okay, next up I have a packet. It's three seventeen now, two forty eight. I did get a price adjustment. Don't forget to um, check your price adjustments daily, guys, because you know you can get a lot of money back. So what it is, it's a container, and it's got a little. We'll pop that on here straight away. So what it is, it's got a little handle. I really like this because I thought this would be really good. It's actually a salad cup. Yeah, mm. I love it. So there's the handle. It goes together like this. Oops. So you can put a salad in the bottom. You can put a snack in the top. And the very top has a little... You can put your little dressing in the top. They do come in different colours. I believe they come in pink, blue and green. Um... Or this one this is the peach I believe um, and this one just screws onto the top oh um, and I'm, putting, I'm putting it on wrong there we go and I just thought that was really nice for a salad and the little fork just sits in there like that Isn't that great guys I love it perfect I'm gonna use that put that over there okay because we're running out of room on the table next up we have this this is a card early education device. That's what it says. And what it does, guys, is it actually reads the cards. I'm going to visit a friend up north. And she has just her, a little granddaughter. And it comes with a charger, which is Timu. And it has a little, tiny, tiny, tiny little... Um, instruction booklet and what it is yeah you hold that up and I'll grab the cards and it comes with uh, a lot of cards <laughs> I can't remember how oh, many cards lots of them. so what you do is I'll show you what you do you pop the card in there no that way you pop the card in and does it work no it just probably needs to be charged uh, hang on we plug it in. We'll plug it in because I went and bought. Remember that that power pack that I called, guys? For those of you who have been here before, I have got a USB port in here. And we shall charge it up a little bit and we'll come back to it. Okay? We'll come back to it. All right. Next up we have, what is this? Oh, who knows? Oh, I know what this is. This one was two ninety eight. Now it's ninety eight cents. What it is? It's a hose. No, no, no. What it is? It's a portable clothesline. Oh. So when you go camping, so it's a big roll, and when you go camping, see the little holes. So what you do? Now I will show you. Now you hold that side up. You hook it to a tree. So there's a little hook on that end. So if that's a tree branch, you hook it on, like so, onto itself, like so. But for these purposes, I'll get Pauline to hold that in. And what you do is when you do your washing, you just stick it in like that and you don't need pegs. You just pull it through. 
and it's a portable clothesline and it's a couple of meters it's probably about I'd say it's about 15 meters how good is that yeah so that's a clothesline <laughs> so I thought wouldn't that be good if you had that in the car or if you went camping if you like hiking even or if you're going swimming you can hang your you can hang your um, towel on it whatever you could even put it near the pool I have a pool at this house and so I could string that up near the pool and you can hang your towels on it that's a great idea good thinking 99 okay up next <coughs> we have crinkle 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 mm. we have this packet and it is a memory bear template I paid $13.48, it's now $8.48. Yes, I did get a price adjustment. Um, so what it is, it's a pattern, and it's a, a hard plastic. You can hold that up, that's probably an ear. That's the front. That's his pants. No, it's the front. That's his belly. That's, oh, I have no idea. Anyway, that's probably face, blah, blah, blah. That's, yeah, anyway, so they're all parts of a teddy bear. I'll just show you. Yeah, I think there is the picture on there. No. Okay, so it has a little instruction booklet and it shows you what all the bits are and yeah, it makes a teddy bear. So it doesn't actually tell you how to do it, but I've sewn before so I'll work it out. So yeah, that's probably the inside of the ear and then you've got the outer ear which you were holding on to. We'll chuck that all in there. Chuck the booklet in, and I'm gonna have fun sorting it out. Ah, we yeah. won't get to colour it. That's ah, all right. I'll work it out. We'll work it. Out. All right. Next up, we have this bag is getting there. Okay, we have this. Again, this is for little guy. I paid fourteen thirty nine. It is still fourteen thirty nine. I'm not gonna open it. But what it is, it's a wooden puzzle thing and you can crank the wheel. I think there's a wheel at the back, a little, and then you put it together and crank it and the man will actually pedal and the wheels will turn. That's quite lovely, isn't it? So that's a little project that little guy and I are going to do. So, yeah. So I will pop that in his wall though. But he will have to do it with me. Okay, here's another little early education card device it's the second one i bought i didn't realize i bought one and then this one i thought this was going to be different but it's actually the same sort of thing but this one's bigger oh. it's, it's exactly the same device but it comes with a carry bag to put everything in it comes with two packs of cards and the same sort of thing so i'll see if this one's charged so it actually has, yeah, totally different cards. So... I don't know what it's supposed to do. But I'm going to give one of these sets to my girlfriend's little granddaughter. Okay, so let's have a look if this one works. Oh, other way around. Is that right? Why does it not work? Why are they not charged? No, it doesn't work. And that's a shame because I really wanted to try it out. Okay, well, like I said, we'll, we'll get that one started and we'll see if it works. Sorry, guys. Anyway, we'll get there. But yeah, this one's actually did cost a bit more, but it's much better quality. It's got more buck, more for your buck. Oh, what else is in there? Something else stopping it. Oh, yeah, of charger. course, the... the the um, USB charger. The charger. Okay, that must go in that way. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> so yeah, so I was going to keep one here and put it in the library so that if anyone comes here with little children, I will probably keep this one and I'll have to charge it up. And yeah, so they can entertain their child. Next up we have this little thing, it is a banana slicer, I believe Eric from the Smile Until It Hurts hauled it, and it's, there yeah, you can play with it, oh. 367 down to 159, hold it up. Why don't we have a banana here? 
Well, I, I was thinking you could even put a cucumber in it. That's what I bought it for. Oh. I'm going to stick the cucumber in because if you have a look there, look at that. And it's quite easy. I have arthritis, so that actually works quite well. And, yeah, you can put a banana in. Don't, don't let little kids use it because if they stick their finger in, they can really hurt themselves. Um, yeah, so I think it's nice. You can cut the banana for a little child. You can... Mm, Really, really cut your cucumbers super fast, just like that. You'll do the whole thing, which is why I bought it. So I'll leave that out of the packet. That's my argument. I love Timu for all their little gadgets. Okay, next up, I have bought another one of these little pill boxes. I actually bought it from the real company, and I think they're called Pocket Pocket P O C K T. I think the original company's called. And Timu's obviously um, taken off. <coughs> seven compartments, isn't it? Uh, five. No, it's got ten. Oh. Here, you try and open that. I can't get it. Okay, so most of the the drugs that are on here, the um, tablets that are on here, are things that we don't use, like Dayquil, Nyquil, Zquil. We don't even have that here. So all these stickers, you get three... Lots of stickers of each thing, so that's those. And then you've got Advil and all that. Well, we don't have that here either. Uh, Pam, Pamprin, yeah, Sinex. We don't have any of these. So if you're in America, you probably do use a lot of these. It's got 10 compartments. They eat all individually open, so you can pop your medications in. Great for travel, great for camping, great for hiking, great for the car. And then again, you get three sheets of these. Again, none of these are going to be any good for us because we don't use any of these in Australia. Well, I use, well, they might, but I've never heard of any of these. Benadryl, yes, we do have Benadryl. We A lot of these we don't use, guys. So if um, maybe I'll put the stickers in a giveaway because when I get to a thousand subscribers which is going to take me forever um, I shall pop these into back into the little bag and I will put them in with the <coughs> giveaways the light's gone off on this thing now okay so let's give it a go pull it out of there pull it out of there let's see if it works no I don't know what it's supposed to do well it's supposed to talk oh Okay, just keep keep charging it. It looks like it's not going to work. I'm so sorry. Normally, Timu is really good with charging things. And I can't see. Yeah, oh, okay. it, does it go that way? Yes, it does. Just plug it back in. It's fine. Okay, so I shall keep the little container. I actually was going to think it would actually be good for um, if you go cruising you can put your little earrings and necklaces in oh, yeah, to keep them it. separate so mm. i'm going to use it for that i'm going to put some earrings in there or something like that okay next up we have $1.98 still a $1.98 and if this is the oh, one stuff. i think it is i got myself a loki and that is loki because he's a little rat bag he comes in like a wrecking ball and i just thought that would be so much like Loki. It is like Loki. So what I've done is I've got a little thing here. Look, look what I've done. I've got this in preparation for when I got this. And I can slot him in there. I'll show you what I'm going to do. So that now, hang on, hang on. It's got to go like that. It's got to be properly done. Properly. Okay, so we're going to put him up somewhere. So I'm going to be changing around my studio because I'm now getting my little room. Well, it's not a little room, it's a big room. But I'm getting this room organised and I'm actually going to have a better backdrop. I'm sitting on a camping table at the moment, which is really low to the ground, isn't it? Yeah, very low. It's very, very low for us older girls. And so I'm waiting. Um, on Wednesday, I'm getting a new dining table, which is bigger than the one I have. I've got such a big dining room now, you can swing it elephant in there so we're going from a six seater to an eight seater however we probably could do with a 12 seater or even bigger it's such a big room but what i'm going to do is i'm going to put the dining table here 
and we're going to have dining chairs to sit on which means that you'll actually be able to see my my chit chat sign again and but my backdrop is going to be changed because these are really really tacky the shelving so i'm going to put my black cube there and we're going to set it up and make it look a little bit more friendly and so there we go we've just put it into there and he will be put up on the wall and yeah so when we get the studio done you'll see loki up on the wall loki if you don't know erin from hey everybody has two cats luna and loki and loki is a black cat with yellow eyes just like that poster and he's a naughty little boy and he's just over a year old and he gets into all sorts of mischief and wrecks her studio and earthquakes the camera moves and blackouts he walks walks across the camera and that's one of the reasons i like watching that show is because i just adore loki and yeah so i had to have my own little loki so yeah so is that again oh yeah that's the movie. okay so yeah so that's what we'll do okay next up we have an item that cost me $3.19, but it has now been discontinued. I have no idea what this is. What is this? What is this? I have no idea. I have no idea what this is. What on earth is this? I have no idea. What is it? I have no idea what this is. No idea. I, if anybody knows what this is, I don't know what it is. I have no idea what it is. Do you know? I have no idea unless it's to hold your phone. No? I don't know. I have no idea what it is. It's got a little rubber thing here. Oh, I think I know what it is. I know what it is. I know what it is. It is a hot glue gun holder. Because I have a hot glue gun holder, and that's the little silicon mat is where... So you put your hot glue gun on there. And it holds it in place and it drips onto there and not your table. Oh. Because okay. I, I had bought one from one of the art um, thingies. And guys, honestly, it did not hold my glue gun. It was meant for a miniature. But this one, yeah, it's a, I think it's a hot glue gun. I think that's what it is. If you know what this is, tell me. But that's what I think it is. I don't know. Some of these bags that I'm hauling have been there for a long, long time. I actually um, got them... Um, already from the old place that I was living at. And so, yeah, they, they could have been months old already. I've still got another two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven bags. Plus, I've got more coming. Okay, now this next item, I actually had these when I was a kid. And it's another, it's another item for a little guy. And it costs $6.39. And what you do is you can flip it. And change the so you can change the shape, make it flat, fold it up, unfold it, and so you can do all these things. And that as you as you change the shape, you can see that the pattern's changing. So you end up having you have to get the three rings. Which, oh, it's been a long time since I had one of these. So you see, guys, you can change it. So now the pattern's all mixed up. So the object of, of this game is to get it so that you end up with three rings. But anyway, that's another little gift for Little Guy. Little Guy, for those of you who don't know, who haven't seen my other videos, um, Little Guy is my grandson. That's what he wants to be known as. He doesn't want his name known online. Um, yeah, so he's Little Guy. He just turned 13 and I spoil him rotten because he's my only grandchild. And probably the only one I'll ever have because my sons don't want children and my daughter never wants any more. Okay, next up we have... Oh, my name's Diane, by the way. I don't think I've ever revealed my name. Have I? I on, don't think so. On any no. of my videos. So I'm actually Diane. There you go. So there's a little bit of news. Okay, next up we have... Uh, paid two forty eight now one seventy eight, And what they are is their little tools... And it's... Uh, Timu did not put them on there. How rude. 
Okay, so what they are is it's a Phillips head and a flat head screwdriver on a key ring. You can chuck it in your car, which is what I'm going to do. You can have fun putting them on for me. No, I can't. I'll break my nails. Oh, but you got real nails, haven't you? Yeah. Oh, good deal. Okay, next up we have a mirror pen. Two forty-five. Oh, sorry, guys. It has been discounted, but I'm sure there are vendors that have them, and I'll show you what it does. Done. Oh, well done. Yay. I'm going to put that. Don't don't put it in the bag. I'm going to stick it in the car. Okay, I won't write on that because that's a gift. I shall write on a piece of card from here. Okay, so it's meant to be a pen now. It's not used, so I'll just get the ink through it. So it's like a paint pen, but it's supposed to be like a mirror. And knowing my luck, it won't work. Wow, that is awesome. It is actually like a mirror. I didn't think, I, I actually, when I bought it, look how good that is. Yeah. It's like a mirror. I don't know if you can see. Probably that dull light, but it is like a mirror. Wow, that is awesome. I didn't think it was going to work. But, yeah, I thought, um, I, I actually bought it because I thought with card making, because we make so many cards, wouldn't that be awesome? Yeah, it's nice. If you do a little background mm -hmm. where you've got a little, uh, you know, like a fancy girl sitting there and you want to draw a little mirror or something, you can actually do that with this. So that's why I bought that. I love it. Mm. Love, love, love it. Okay, that is the end of the little bag. Or is it? That felt like there was something in there. Right, that's it. Okay, we're up to the big bag, guys. Okay, shoes. first up, pair of shoes. And they look like dancing shoes. Okay. I have big hoofers, so these are a size 41, which I believe is about a nine. Okay, I paid 22.58 and they are still thirty-two fifty-eight. Very pretty. And what they are? Oh, they've got the little, the little shape keepers. And they're really, really pretty. They have got. They're pink, but just not showing up the pink. No, they're pink and white. Mm. Yeah, yeah, you can see the pink, pink and white. <coughs> and they've got little diamantes, aren't they? Lovely, and they got the lovely little heel, and they got the lo lovely little zip at the back with that little pull. And so, yeah, and I have very, very, even though I'm a fat girl, um, have big fat neck, big fat belly, but I don't have a butt and I don't, I have tiny, tiny little ankles. And so these look really nice. I can't wait to wear them. They're lovely. They got a little satin toes. I really like them. Oh, they're pretty. Yeah, I'll take that out. I will put them on my shoe rack. Lovely. I'm looking forward to it. Okay, next up we have containers. These are large and they are a set of five. They come in three sizes. This is the large. Uh, they come in small and medium as well. Um, these cost me $7.97 and they're now $7.48. And what they are... Okay, so here's the lids. What they are is they're little containers. They open at the base. You can put liquids in them. You can put cereal in them. They come with a lid. I won't twist it because then it will crack the lid part. So if you want that to be, if you're selling things, these have the secure lids. Once you put them on um, tightly, they are um, sealed. And yeah, I just thought if you go camping, you can put water in them, you can put oats in them, you can put cereals in them, you can Basically do whatever. Anything. So yeah, so there's a set of five and they do come with lids, which are separate. As I said, they have that safety seal. So once you pop them on, you have to pull the seal off to get them open. So I'm not going to put the, the lids on tight. I'm just going to pop them back in the bag. I have no idea why I bought them. Um, I don't go camping. Well, I love camping, but my husband does not. But I, he, he likes glamping. His, 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 his idea of camping. Now he's one of nine. I'm one of six. Um, 
he his idea of camping is to go in a in a room where you get running water, micro microwave, um, shower, your own toilet. Um, yeah, so that's he likes to glamp. Yeah, I mean, so, so he he likes cabins, whereas I like to rough it. Because my, my, my parents took us camping a lot. And, yeah, I used to love it. I love it. Let's check that behind me. Next up. Oh, this is good. Okay, next up we have this little box. I know what it is. It is a multifunction cleaner. Oh, and I don't have to undo it. It's great. What did I pay? It must have been free. No, it wasn't free. But I haven't written on what it costs. Okay. What it is, is... It's a water cleaner, so it has little suction feet. It's battery operated, no charger with this one, and it's not. I haven't, oh, and the batteries come with it. Mm. And what you do is you fill this up with water, and then you um, you can either put your glasses, these you can oh. put them in, and it cleans them, or you can put jewelry in them. Um, you can put, what you do is with the water, you actually put a little bit of um, dish Did washing powder, yeah, uh, dishwashing liquid in. And then it, what it does is when you turn it on, it vibrates and it vibrates all the little bits of dirt. So you can use it for jewellery, for glasses. <laughs> um, no, well, it's probably not charged. <laughs> yeah, so I'm really happy with that. Can't wait to use it. Because what gets me is my glasses, you know, the little nose thingies. Why do they go green? I, don't I know, know. I know. I know, it's, yeah, I know it's from sweat. Well, I skin. sweat. I, see, I sweat. My face sweats a lot. I don't know why. I'm just a real sweater. Okay, guys. Next up. Oh, I've got a couple of these. Ooh. Now, a couple of weeks ago, I hauled some of these anime dolls. I've, I seem to go through stages. So, my latest phase, like. I, I went through the badge stage. There are probably some still around. Um, I went through um, anime dolls. I went through... Um, now I went through and whole, um, bought a lot of earrings. Mm. Okay, so this little beautiful darling costs $9.98 and it's discontinued, but they do come up occasionally. Um, so, yeah, she's, she just sits on a shelf. Then I've got this gorgeous little one. She costs uh, $9.48, also discontinued, guys. But, like I said, there are thousands of vendors, so I'm sure there's a vendor there that would have them. Um, really pretty. They're really detailed, and I just love them. And I'm going to find, um, in my library, I'm going to put up a shelf, and I'm going to put them all on there. Okay, this next one cost me $12.48, also discontinued. Um, do you remember, for those of you who have been here before, remember I pulled the pink one that I'm going to put in my room? Well, this is the blue one, and they're both different, and I just love them. I think she's got her beautiful little slippers on. I don't know if they come off. No, they don't. Yeah, she's just really cute. So that's what I bought that for. So I will put her back in there. So when, when I find the other ones, because I don't know where I've put them now, but I will put them all together. I thought that would be really nice. Okay, next up we have... More of those bags. More of those bags, yeah. but these ones are also large. They're exactly the same as the other ones. So I'll just pop them up there for now. Okay, now we're getting to the big stuff. This Ooh. one is a big box. It cost me... Uh, what did I pay? Oh, I'll leave this one till last because it's a silicon doll. Oh, is it? It's a baby. Oh. I forgot I ordered another one. This one must be really old because I don't remember. I thought I... Okay. I didn't think I had another baby. Oh, and we haven't done any thumbnails. I always forget to do a thumbnail. Do and you the, know what? Do it with the baby. Yeah. And you know what happens? I end up having to go through the video and try to pause my video and try oh. to get me with a nice face, which I don't have because I'm not smiling. And so, yeah, so I end up with a horrible I'll thing. I'll do it with a baby. Okay, uh, speaking of badges, I found one in here because I must have thrown a couple in here. 
This one costs three dollars and it's still three dollars. And what it is, it says it's never too late for a plot twist. <laughs> I love badges. And look, it's almost full. I've started the second one over there. So I okay. started the third one actually. No, that other one's gibbets oh. for crops. Okay, next up, I've been waiting for this. Oh, wow. Next up, we have a large self-healing cutting mat. Because remember, Pauline can laugh at me now. Pauline came to my old house and she came arts and crafting. And I had one of these, exact same one. Paid a lot of money for it. <laughs> And I used a rotary blade on it, guys. Now, I'm telling you now. So, I was cutting away, cutting away, because I thought I was really clever with my rotary blade. And when we finished, I went to pick it up. And it fell to pieces, because I cut it to pieces. <laughs> there was nothing left of it. It was shredded. So, this one's an A2 size. I paid $22.09. Uh, <clears throat> it's now $19.40 and it actually has on one side it has the angles so you can use that for measurements on angles and on this side it's actually got shapes you can use these for card making for quilting for anything like that for cutting but just use a normal blade do not use a rotary blade because you will chop it to pieces <laughs> so yeah so I love this. I love it. I've been waiting for it. I've only got the tiny, tiny little ones about this big. And when I'm doing big projects, it's just no good. No. Just can't work with it. Okay, so I've been looking forward to that one. Next up we have... Okay. Okay, now I've been waiting for this one too. Now, this one cost me $24.79. And it's now $21.34. Did it get a price adjustment? What? I'm not going to unpack it. What it is, is it's a shoe rack and it actually has a curtain. Can you see that? So, yeah. And I think it can hold from memory. Now, I did buy another shoe rack from Timu and I thought it was really rude because it's the one that's in the laundry and it's two bays and it, on their photo, like, it looked like it took up a whole wall like these racks. Yeah. And it looked like it could hold about 30 or 36 shoes. That was tiny. And when I got it, it only holds like like two on each shelf. And theirs showed four or five on each shelf. And I'm oh. like, guys, that's just false advertising. And I'm hoping that this one, now this one's got, uh, it's got one, I mean, two, three, four, five, that, five, 10, 15, either. 20, 25, 30, 35. So this one, if you were to put, it looks like it would hold 40 pairs of shoes. But now, I know for a fact shoes. that when I put the shoes on there, it would probably hold 15. Mm -hmm. So we'll see. It only looks very, very small. There's no way that you could fit five pairs of shoes on here. You could probably fit two, maybe three at a squeeze. Because that's the size of the shelf. So I think they're... Lying. Mm -hmm. But anyway, I bought that one for for the laundry as well. Once I clean that area up. Next up we have okay. There's two more items in here. Yeah. Oh. Oh. This one is in the box. This one I paid eighteen thirty nine. Now mm. eleven nineteen. That's a big drop. Yeah. Oh, mm. I know. I know what this is. Okay. First up, it's got these little evil little evil little hooks. There's a whole bunch of them just sitting on top. Uh, I know what this is. I think. Oh, more star. Oh, really? It's oh. already falling apart. No! No! And look, there's styrofoam everywhere! Oh, I hate this. Oh, tip it upside down. No, no, no. Look, um, you know what? 
I, I've got no room in this garbage bag. Oh, there's fluff everywhere. It's everywhere. It's just falling apart. I'm trying to pull it out. And it's just falling apart. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Oh, goodness. Okay. What it is, is their little glass vases that you, it has a hole in the back. So you hook it onto the wall. There's, hold that one. There's one, two, three. Ah, uh, oh, it's snowing in here, guys. Look at it, it's snowing. <coughs> There's four. Four of them. Now you can either, you can put little um, plants in them. Mm, just fill them up with water. I do. Yeah. I have no idea where I'm putting these. I might, I might actually put them on the wall over there. You can put little cactus in them. If you um, get a tiny little cactus, you can put some gravel in the bottom. Ah, this, there's balls of styrofoam everywhere. So that's what I'm going to do with them, guys. I'm going to actually maybe put. No, oh, oh, look at that fluff everywhere. Okay, I'm just going to put that back in. I'm not going to put the other bit on top. I'm just going to leave it there. Oh, my goodness. Look at all these what a mess. Things. Yeah, I think they're the hooks. Oh, so they... Oh, okay, so it's for a gyp rock wall. So what you do is you hold that against the wall and then you hammer that and then it holds it in place. So that, that they'll go into the wall. But, yeah, I... You'd have to find a stud, wouldn't you? I might actually keep oh. them for... Um, oh, that hurt. Ow. Oh. <laughs> Ow. Um, look, it's, oh, it's everywhere. This, this whole thing here is just full of styrofoam. I, I might actually wait until my brand is built and then I might put them out there. I, I have no idea what I'm... I'm going to just leave that down there behind you. In there. In there. All right. Okay, last box. This is your... this is wheat. Now remind me, we've got to do a thumbnail. Yeah. Okay. So this one, guys, is a little reborn baby, and it's a thirty-two centimeter or twelve point six inches, and I paid one hundred and thirty-eight ninety-nine. All my prices are in Australian dollars because we're down under, and it's silicon. So let's see. Okay, it comes wrapped in a bag. Now the other one that I haul is a little boy. Was it a little boy the first one? I, I think had? so. This one I believe is a little girl, or it might be the other way around. I'm not sure. I can't remember. No, this one's a boy. I think. It's a blue bottle. It's got a blue bottle, so I assume and it comes with a little birth certificate now I remember the last one I hauled it had a big dent in the head remember so I all do I've noticed errands all yeah. have dents in the head so what I'm going to do I'm actually going to put some hair in it because I can reborn so oh, it's all wrapped up <laughs> and it is a little boy now they are He's sleeping hang on. and it is anatomically correct so he has a little willy, but we won't look at that. Oh, this one's not as bad. Look, this one's only really tiny. That look, one's doable. He's so soft. Look he's at that. He's squishy. Look, he's so stretchy. He's like one of those. Oh. Do you remember those? Sorry. Oh. Do you remember those stretchy? Yeah. I think they were. <coughs> what were they called? I don't know. You get giraffes and all sorts <coughs> of things. They, they were. He, he's like a strong man. <coughs> and then you grab his arms and you pull them like this little baby has. It <coughs> reminds me of that toy. But he's really heavy. He's got a really floppy head. He did have a hat on a minute ago. He did, but hair, yeah, that's half the size. Not even. That's yeah. really little. I can live with that. But here, look at his face. He's so cute. And he's got little eyelashes. And I am happy with him. He's got a big, big <coughs> not belly. And he has been completely reborn, so he's been highlighted and blushed. He's a full silicon doll. He's got he's not vinyl at all. 
So he's got no creases at all. And he does have anatomical bits, which we're not going to show. And, yeah, so the other one's a little girl and this one's oh. a little boy. But I'm, I've actually got little knitted outfits that I want to put on them to make them a pair of twins. Because I think they're the same sculpt. Was the other one awake or asleep? Uh, I think it's asleep as well. I can't remember. I think no. it is. Okay, so we'll do a thumbnail. Let's smile at the camera. <laughs> so cute. Okay. So I think he's really cute. Um, I'm really happy with him. He's really adorable. And as I said, he comes with, that's all he comes with. So it's a lot of money for just a bottle. I mean, the bottle is almost the size of him. Look at that. If that was a real baby, oh. the bottle would be the size of a car. <laughs> That's cute. But he is adorable. I really like him. I'm actually going to put him um, in a little knitted outfit. A little. I'm going to. I've got nappies that will probably fit him, or diapers. And I'm going to maybe put a little bit of hair in. Maybe not. He should be okay. I might put hair in the other one though because it's got a really flat head, mm. hasn't it? But yeah, I really like this one, guys. So, so cute. cute. Anyway, guys, that's um. So we've done an hour. We've been talking to you with you for an hour. We appreciate spending time with you. We love making videos for you. It's like visiting with friends. I always like seeing you guys. I miss it when I don't do a haul. This is working. Oh, okay. Is it? Let's see if it works now. I don't know why it's not working. Because it, it oh. anyway, I will I will charge that one overnight and see, and if I get it working next time I do a video, um, I will definitely come back and show you because I don't want to leave it there. I will put that away. I'll put that on charge and keep it on charge, and then yeah, we will show you. But it comes with a whole bunch of cards, and they have cow. They've got. Animals, they've got items, they've got policemen, they've got colour codes. So I think the yellow, okay, so the yellow cards are all animals. So there's a whole bunch of animals. And what the little gadget does, it actually um, talks and it says what they are. Then the blue cards, so there's four different colour cards. The blue cards are different transports, so taxi, aeroplane, oh no, and they also have items like bowl, chips, uh, chopsticks, table lamp, so they're all objects, so transport things and objects. Then we have green cards and they are food, food items, so fruits, vegetables, drinks milk, noodles, sandwich, all that sort of thing. And then the pink cards are, they have a lot of family in them. So uncle, sister, father, but they've also got colors and they've got um, like a nurse, firefighter, teacher. So, you know, for a young child, that's really, really educational. And so if we get that going, well, we'll let you know. But, yeah, so what it does is it actually, you pop the card in and the card will actually speak the word. So that's really cute. And it actually looks a bit like a cat. It looks in the shape of a cat. It's got little whiskers and ears. So, yeah, so we shall get that going, keep it on charge. I'll probably charge it in the kitchen. And, yeah, we'll see how it goes. So... That's our haul, guys. Thanks very much for stopping by. Hope that you, if you're new to my channel, I hope that you like what you saw. Um, I do Timu hauls. I will be doing some more videos. Um, might be showcasing some of my own um, Reborn dolls that I have made that are for sale. Um, I might do some cards. I'll show you some cards, stuff that I've made. Maybe even a few journals. Maybe if we've got time tomorrow, we can show some of the journals yeah. we've made. And, yeah, so we'll come and have a chat then. So thanks for stopping by. Um, always remember, guys, um, 
when you do visit, if, if you've got the time, please, please, please press the like button and thumbs up or thumbs down because it helps my channel grow. Um, I've only got 37 subscribers so far, but we're growing. And by you putting the like and the thumbs up, thumbs down, it actually shows YouTube that I have real people watching. So it helps my channel a lot. So, um, yeah, so thanks for that. Always be nice to each other. Be kind. Do you have anything to add? No, just no? a very well good night. It's been lovely. Yep. And thank you for helping. That's I've okay. Enjoyed You're having you with me. I think I'll let you do another one tomorrow. Okay. What do you think? Well, okay. Yeah, we'll see <laughs> what we can find. Okay, guys, thanks a lot. And I'll see you again when I'm looking at you. Okay. Bye for now. Good night.